Hi, it's Mike again. Welcome to another how-to video. Today, I'm going to show you how to upgrade your interior lights of your Gen 2 Tacoma to LEDs. Makes a big difference. So let's see what we got here. I got replacement bulbs. So I have a 194 bulb, which is the map light, and then I have the 578 bulb, which is the door light. So the door light brand, it's called Sirius LED and they are extremely bright, a 578 bulb, 6000 Kelvin Xeon white. And it says it's 41 millimeters. So this is a direct plug and play for the other um, normal incandescent bulb. So to get out these bulbs, I would recommend getting the auto trim removal kit. And I just picked up this five piece, piece kit from Amazon as well. And it's pretty handy, They're pretty cheap. And all you really need is, are these little clips here and that will help you take the lens covers off. And I'll show you how to do that. So before I take off this cover, I'll show you what the normal stock incandescent bulb looks like. Just has that nice warm glow to it. So what you wanna do is just take one of these pry bars and go up on the driver's side. There's a little groove in there and you just kind of poke it in there and just kind of work at it and it should come off and then it'll just hang down by the tab on that side. And then all you have to do is pull that bulb out. And that's it. So this is the replacement bulb. It has the LEDs on one side and a heat sink on the other side. So we want to make sure that the heat sink faces up and it just slides right into place. So we'll give that a shot. Just angle that just right. Let's make sure it works. Whoa. Pop this back in. There you go. Let's try it again. That's quite a bit different. Awesome. So when it comes to the map light, it's a little bit more trickier. Um, I did one side already and I'll show you the difference. So this is the incandescent bulb and then this one is the LED bulb. And you can see that's quite a bit different as well really illuminates the cap quite a bit. So the trick to this is to do the inside first. So take your pry bar again and push it in and kind of pull that out like that. And then you have to go on this side and kind of pop that out in there and that's it. Little button, we'll just turn that off. So you can see they're just, they're not really, they have little grooves on them. So that, that's the inside. So you want to get this little flange passed out and then you just go on either side to pry it off. So that's the first step. And the second step is trying to get that bulb out there. It's, it's kind of, uh, it's wedged in there pretty good. So I've, I found a way, an easy way to get this a little bit of a hack. So what I ended up doing was needle nose pliers and I put some electrical tape around that and the electrical tape will actually provide a little bit of traction Description, if you want to call it, or some tact, so you can pull on that bulb. You just kind of get in there and kind of wiggle it around. Oh, oh, there you go. So these 194 bulbs are kind of interesting. They have three LEDs, so one that shines straight down, and one on either side, and it looks like they have some surface mount resistors to dissipate some of the power. So now that they're all installed and they illuminate the cabin pretty good. I like them. Um, some LED bulbs are obnoxiously bright and kind of have this grayish blue tinge to them, but uh, these don't really. So what I'll do is I'll put a link in the description on what I purchased and hopefully it works for you too. And once again, thanks for watching.